Where is the bill? Where the heck is the bill? Republicans now demanding to see details of the president's health care plan that he announced last night. My next guest is one of them, Congressman Louis Gohmert, uh, even holding up a sign to that effect during the president's speech. He never told him to shut up or call him a lie or any of that. Congressman Gohmert joining me right now. Congressman, good to have you. It's always good to be with you, Neil. Um, Congressman, what do you think of the, the pressure and the, the, the agita your, your colleague, uh, Joe Wilson, has been getting? Well, it's very unfortunate. I, when I was told that Joe was the one who had yelled out uh, uh, what he did, I, I was surprised. I didn't think that would be Joe. But, uh, you know, it's deeply frustrating, Neil. We've been hearing for months about the president's plan, my plan, my bill, my plan, my bill. And, and then he's been going around like on Monday saying, well, we were lying about his plan and that we have no solutions. Well, I know neither one of those things is true. And then he comes in there last night and today he's, he's left everybody in a vague situation where some members saying, no, he embraced H.R. 3200. Others saying, no, he's, he's talking about a new plan. I just want to know what plan. Is he talking about H.R. 3200? Is he not talking about it? Because he keeps saying we're the ones that are lying. He said last night we were not being honest. In, in, in trying to use scare tactics. So a lot of well, you guys have been Bill saying, when, when, when about? you were showing this what bill and everything else, some of your colleagues started doing the same. Was the president looking at you? Did he, did he give you any special attention or did anyone well, come up with anything? Well, I, it look, of course, I know that he spends most of the speech looking at the teleprompter, and I don't mean that in a mean way. I mean, that's, that's just what he does. But then when there's applause and pauses, it looked like he may have looked at my sign. I genuinely want to know what bill, what plan is he talking about? If it's H.R. 3200, then we can clearly go through those 1,018 right. pages. You just don't know what plan it says because every time well, he says, yeah, you know, you can't criticize my plan because I don't have a plan, don't you dare criticize exactly. my plan, right? All right, I understand where yeah, you're coming it on. It is a who's on first deal. Um, but but yeah. let me ask you this Nancy Pelosi uh, gave uh, your colleague, uh, Joe Wilson, what I call the death stare when he popped up like that. Um, what, did, what did she do to you or when you were holding a sign or uh, did, did your, 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 your security card work today? What? <laughs> no, and actually, in fairness, I never held it up. I had it sitting in my lap. No, it was kind of hard to miss. Was, kind of, it was kind of, I was covering well, this. Okay. It was kind of hard to miss. But now what I did have, when he, when he talked about ideas and other plans, we did hold up plans. I held up my bill that I would like to have. When he says there are no solutions, he needs to know that whoever's feeding his teleprompter saying that is not right. They're not feeding him accurate information. All right, by so, the way, yeah, Congressman, as you were speaking, today. as you were speaking, we ran the Nancy Pelosi death stare because I had a fourth grade teacher <laughs> like that, and I, I, I barely got out of fourth grade. But that's a whole nother story. Oh, I had a fourth a whole grade discussion. teacher like yeah. that. All right, so yeah. where does the, the things stand now? You guys are saying we need the details of the plan. There's the famous death stare. Um, and then we don't, we, we got the broad blueprints, I guess, of one. So where does this go? I don't, we didn't even get the broad blueprints of one. I think he's still talking basically about 3,200, but just with, with some additional aspects to it. That's the way it appears, but he has been purposely vague. He also said, you know, uh, my door is always open, that if you have serious uh, proposals, then I'll, I'll hear them. Uh -huh. Well, what we found today is his door may be open, but there's a lot of really heavily armed guards <laughs> and heavy gates between that open door and people like me. And they're They've said Take maybe I can it. talk Just to the other end senior. of Pennsylvania. Haven't you just walk over there? Yeah, yeah. Congressman, always. And one other thing. Go, uh, I we, wish we had more time. Said, and I, I will get you back. I yeah. promise. We're just tight for time here. Uh, well, always you, good Nick. having you, Congressman. You. When we thank come back, you. the census that includes illegal immigrants, the health care plan that doesn't. Wait a minute. Actually, wait about two minutes. This one you got to hear.